I am Robert Bristow, the architect of the modern port of Cochin in the state of Kerala in India. I decided to travel through time to see the outcome of my efforts. The ancient port of Maziris was destroyed by a great flood in AD 1341, leading to Cochin's emergence as the main port of the region and its reference as the Queen of the Arabian Sea. The scent of Cochin's aromatic spices drew the Western world to India, resulting in a series of expeditions that changed our history forever. There exists a long history of trade between Kerala and foreign nations. This legacy enriched Cochin and her inhabitants through time. History is witness to many developments initiated by the visitors to Cochin. This is where I came in. I was assigned in 1920 to construct a deep water sheltered harbour, transforming Cochin into one of the safest ports in the world. The 20th century witness the replacement of wooden sail ships. The first container reached Cochin in November 1973 on board the President Tyler. The increasing use of containers for transportation of cargo worldwide reinforces the need for modern container terminals. Cochin Port harnesses the twin advantage of a vibrant hinterland with a healthy and booming Indian economy. A robust platform indeed for the growth of domestic container traffic. Cochin is one of the fastest growing ports in the country. Cochin's greatest advantage is its proximity to the east-west trade routes, offering the shortest deviation from both the Suez and Middle East routes compared to any other Indian port and advantages of natural, favourable ocean currents. Cochin is an all-weather port offering round-the-clock ship operations. Cochin experiences only insignificant tidal variations and offers the reliability of calm waters not available in most other Indian ports, particularly during the monsoon season. With excellent sea, road and rail connectivity to all parts of India and connectivity with the rest of the world, Cochin is the ideal location as a hub and transshipment centre for India and the subcontinent. A major step in Cochin's development was the arrival of DP World, a Dubai-based company and the world leader in port management services who took over the operations of the Rajiv Gandhi Container Terminal on the 1st of April 2005. A new state-of-the-art International Container Transshipment Terminal, ICTT at Vallapadam, has been developed as the first port-based SES and transshipment hub in India. DP World's motto is to serve its customers better than anyone else, with investment in infrastructure ahead of demand. This is the completed ICTT, which covers an area of 115 hectares, developed in three phases. A draft of 14.5 metres and the state-of-the-art key equipment allows for the handling of the largest container vessels afloat today. The initial phase provided for a handling capacity of 1 million TEUs. Over 600 metres of key, supported by six Super Post Panamax twin lift cranes with a minimum capacity of 25 moves per hour. <music> 3,500 ground slots, including 450 reefer points. 15 Eco RTGs. And 50 ITVs.
In the final phase, ICTT offers over 1,800 meters of key length, 18 key cranes, 54 RTGs, 15,000 ground slots, a gate complex with seven gates each way and a handling capacity of over 3 million TEUs. All equipments are serviced and maintained by a state-of-the-art workshop ensuring maximum uptime. Trailers entering the terminal have access to a modern waybridge before entering the documentation area. Three gates are provided each way for trailers moving in and out of the terminal. A special gate for project cargo and oversized consignments. High levels of safety are maintained through surveillance cameras and other security equipment. Provision for a scanner is also planned for the screening of containers. DP World believes strongly in training all staff for superior customer service and productivity. New equipment and qualified personnel ensure fast vessel turnaround times and lower port charges. DP World is committed to preserving the environment. The ICTT offers excellent rail, road and coastal connectivity, enhanced by the development of inland waterways and customers will benefit from cost-effective logistic solutions. A new electrified rail link capable of handling 15 trains each way with provision for doubling the capacity will connect ICTT to the rest of the country. The new four-lane national highway from ICTT provides surface connectivity to the two major highways. The NH17 connects to the Konkan region, whilst the NH47 connects to the growing hinterland in the south, central and the east. The imminent development of the coastal highway will provide additional access to the two national highways. Cochin offers excellent connectivity to the ports on the west coast of India, such as Mundra, Kandla, Oka, Pipavav, Jawaharlal Nehru Port Trust and Kawa. On the east coast, Cochin is connected to Tutikorin. Plans are afoot to connect Chennai, Vishakhpatinam and Haldia, thereby ensuring complete coastal support. DP World's international network offers seamless connectivity around the globe. DP World is committed to supporting alternative transportation initiatives for better transportation capacity and environment-friendly transportation. The port-based SES offers plenty of potential to expand container-related businesses with value addition centers, a free trade warehousing zone, etc. Exciting projects already initiated include Barrett Petroleum Single Point Mooring Facility for the handling of very large crude carriers and Petronet LNG's terminal and regasification plant. An international bunkering terminal is on the drawing board while an international ship repair complex will enable non-survey repairs and other minor repairs. Cochin Port will also be setting up a cruise terminal of international standard. The proposed Kochi Marina project will offer world-class berthing facilities. The Volvo Ocean Race stopover focused the attention of the whole world on Cochin, with many local businesses capitalizing on it. Cochin also houses some of the best connected IT parks in India with lower operational costs compared to other major cities in India. The metro rail track connecting the various parts of the city will help make Cochin's traffic more fluid.
The National Geographic Traveller has named Kerala as one of the 50 destinations of a lifetime. With its unparalleled natural beauty and Ayurveda rejuvenation centres, Kerala has carved a niche for herself in the tourism circuit. Cochin has changed enormously during the past century. Cochin Port is one of the fastest growing ports in the country and is expected to maintain an impressive growth rate over the next decade, while its ideal location offers numerous advantages to the business community. Cochin Port also offers outstanding connectivity to all major ports and cities in India, as well as to other countries. Truly, the International Container Transshipment Terminal at Vallapadam is the jewel in the crown of the Queen of the Arabian Sea. It is the ideal solution for transporting your goods to and from India, as well as a transshipment center for ports in the region. The platform that DP World has set up will provide you with the means to build on the tremendous growth that India is poised to experience in the coming years, both in terms of Exim and domestic trade. Be among the first ones to seize this opportunity. Gain first mover advantages with the potential for long-term financial gain. The prospects are there for you to make the most of. So do not miss out. Come. Experience the power of partnership.